now I have to call an audible with Play Like a Raven. I have first year defensive coordinator, Coach Dean Pease joining us. Thanks for having me. Here's the audible. Normally throughout the year, we've been able to isolate on single players, but in this particular case, you pulled off some film that really typifies what Play Like a Raven is all about. Well, in this particular play, this is against San Francisco on Thanksgiving uh, evening. Mm. Purnell right here is gonna have it, McPhee is gonna have a chance to beat this guard and actually make a play here in the backfield as you can see right here. All right, now what happens in a lot of defenses is that 10 guys will kind of say, well, he's made the play and stand around and watch it. But we always say you play until you hear the whistle. When you watch 99, does a great job here of slap ripping on the guard and does a good job, arm over, makes the play in the backfield. But that's a great running back, right? Yep, He's gonna make people miss. And I've seen a ton of guys all of a sudden stop here and then the guy breaks out of the pack. Watch the rest of the defense right here finish the play. Ed Reed, Jamil McClain, Kruger, all of them, they're Bernard all going. Pollard, McPhee's Kruger. back up off the ground running. So when Frank Gore finally ends up getting tackled actually out here by the corner, okay, so now he's in the play, but look at the shirts around him. So if you're Frank Gore getting up off the play right here, that's what you see. Nine guys swarming him right now. It's also a fact that here's a guy that's blocked, and now all of a sudden he's, this guy, you know, he just get, get out of my way here by Haloti. <laughs> and that's not, that's not a fun position to be no. in if you're a wide receiver. It's like, I don't really need to go down there and crack anymore. So that's the idea of playing Raven defense right there.